Drivers behind the line. Three, two, one. Power up. Way off. Blue Alliance flying down the laneway, crossing the field like they cross players on the court. 1391 with the equalizer. But can the Beak Squad respond in time? No is the answer to that. 50-43 blue as pit drivers pick up their controls. 1391 with a rim rattler, eases one over. While the Beak Squad puts up the three with their partner Goodrich from Michigan. 28-34, that Michigan State Championship chairman's winning team. Grabbing in their gullet a cube. They rise to the occasion, slide one on. The Beak Squad, easing one over, takes the next couple cubes and pulls the point spread into their favor for the blue. Wow, the Blackhawks, down by about a cycle, can only just maintain pulling it out of the blue favor. The red, with the force control, grabs that amount of points. 130 to 130 all, with 75 left in this match. We're seeing the Reds got one cube in their boost vault. So they're probably gonna be looking to spend that as this match continues. But we've got all three blue going for a triple stack on the scale, defending the onslaught that this Red Alliance is giving. But the blue with their boost really pulls that away with the points. Spreading this one out by about 60. We've got 45 left, and the question is, who's gonna come out on top? Down on the blue side, Bionic Blackhawks run the laneway, get a little tippy, get a little topsy-turvy, and in the end, they beef it on the delivery. With 30 seconds left in this one, time winds down, with blue leading 315 to 204. Martians looking to take their show on the road, Back to outer space where they came from. We've got two blue in the air. Two red trying to score as they play their boost. One up for the red. Blue with the force. Two, one, zero. They put up a 423 to 311 victory with four ranking points. Because a rising tide lifts off ships, each of those teams moves up in the rankings. And you'll want to be in the top eight if you want to pick come tomorrow morning. <laughs>